Let's sand body mount. Go ahead and install the gates first. Don't tighten them all the way yet. Saw our floating ply mount. These are our M uh, M two five millimeter flatheads. Now, if you're gonna use the, uh, pop mount uh, shim for a roll center change, um, it's easier to change it, to install it from this side instead of this side, um, because if you're trying to change it uh, during a race, you don't have to take the whole back of the car apart to put this on. You simply just loosen up these screws, slide it in, and snug back up. And then you'll, you'll set your actual feel for it once you um, get the rest of it put together. All right, so now that we got that, that done, we're gonna go ahead and install the um, Vexan body mount. So it looks like that together. Now I'm gonna take this back apart and go ahead and install the pods so you can see how it fits. Easiest way to do this is go sideways, in, and then snap like that. And it's gonna be tight at first because your pod mount is tight for now. You'll adjust that in a few minutes. These are four millimeter button heads. Now, before you adjust the uh, tightness of the pod mount, make sure that your gap, because this, this can move a little bit, so your gap here, you're gonna wanna, this is why we didn't tighten those all the way. You're gonna get that to where it's right where you want it at. It should be about a one millimeter gap, like so. Now you're going to tighten these all the way. Like that, good. Now we're going to take our pod mount, we're going to rotate a quarter screw out. See how it dropped? And there you go. It's about right. Perfectly smooth.